first started looking into the yards, the main criteria we sort of looked at was OH&S, which was um, one of the key points for us, just to be able to work as many numbers as we do through the yards, but also keep employees safe, uh, not having to get like in with the cattle um, for every every time we put them through. Uh, the other the other criteria for us was um, ease of being able to put the animals through the yards and also um, from a stock perspective as well, minimum brews um, as we trade a lot of, lot of steers but also um, when we're drafting and, and drafting cows and calves up etc just to keep the animals as less uh, as low stressed as possible um, and in saying that too we can use a lot of low stress principles with these yards um, as we're not having to uh, you know get right behind the cattle and try and give them up the race as they seem to flow straight through with uh, without us having to sh open and shut gates all the time um, we can basically have it have it set up all the way through to the crush and they'll feed through without any big yahooing or anything like that um, from the start. Um, and yeah, basically we can, we can weigh uh, up to sort of 150 to 200 or you know, 500 kilo steers within an hour. So we sort of do 150 to 200 an hour, um, going five ways over the scales with just two of us in the yard. So from that, from that point of view, it's um, massively labour efficient and um, effective for us to get them through. Uh, the yards, the yard setup we've got is the, the curved race and also we have the um, air operated uh, backing guns. Uh, it allows us to basically have one person running from the back gate all the way through the crush and the label. Uh, it saves us manually from opening and shutting but also we can have you know, one person down the back keeping the cattle flowing through and one person just operating on the gates. Um, it's, it also, we involve our, our drafting count, which basically do a lot of our cow and calf drafting in there. Um, same, same sort of scenario, it only takes two of us to, to operate that. Um, and flowing through there all the way through the, through the crush, we, we would go five ways out of the play box. Um, all the cattle go out onto water straight away if, they, if they're coming through, as every can has water. Um, and it's all the gates are all um, at quick latches as well, so there's no, it's less chance, I should say, of um, injury to, to uh, the operator. Uh, within the within the herd, every every animal has an MLIS um, tag, and all those animals are reported onto our true test weigh box, our yellow box, I should say. So every time an animal comes through through the cattle yards, it gets a weight gets recorded against it. So we can go back through, and trace that animal straight back from basically from weaning to the time it leaves the property or or is joined, for example, with the heifers. That we can see what weight gain it's done from from start to finish. 